What's going on everyone? Dr. Peter. Another step progression to do with the hip hinge motion is to now take the one done in a previous video where you're sitting to now doing it in standing. And this is going to be more relatable to the more functional movements like squatting and deadlifting like we mentioned. So what you're going to do here is you're going to get close to a wall. You can vary how far away your heel is from the wall. The farther away is going to make it even harder. So what you're going to do here, again, the whole focus of here is keeping your back nice and upright as your hip hinges, kind of like Thor. And so you're going to stay here, back upright, and you're going to push your butt back, a little bend to the knees, tap your butt to the wall, come back up. The wall is used as a target so that you're actually pushing your hips backwards rather than just falling forward. So you're here, push the butt back, tap the wall, come back up. Just like the other motions, you can do it um, with a hold or do it for reps. So you want to take that hip hinge motion, transfer it into standing with a nice good cue, give this one a try.